Hi, this is Matt from Tradesman Digital Marketing. In today's video, I'm going to walk you through demographic settings inside Google Ads, how to adjust them and how to get the best results with them. So first off, we're going to click on all campaigns and we're going to scroll down to audiences. Uh, something I should note is the demographic settings is actually changed at the ad group level. So if you want to just click on your ad group, that might be easier for you to adjust it, but I want to show you every step involved. So I'm just going to take the long way. So I'm going to click on all campaigns, audiences, and then demographics and edit demographics. Uh, and in this table, by the way, it will show you when you actually have real data inside of it, all of the clicks, all of the performance metrics, you can adjust them through here, uh, whether it's conversions, competitive metrics, performance, whatever you want, uh, and you can compare them by age, gender, and household income. So we're gonna click on edit demographics. We're gonna select our ad group. We're gonna come down to the actual campaign we want the uh, ad group to appear in. Uh, we're gonna click this specific ad group. And now we're able to adjust our demographic settings. And this really comes down to how well you know your customer persona and who you're actually targeting. So say we're doing pool installation like this demo account is set up for. We generally know people who are 18 to 24 aren't looking for pools generally because they don't have that amount of money. And again, this is uh, stereotyping and we just want to go with the uh, highest conversion rate. So generally we would get rid of 18 to 24 year olds um, right off the bat, even 25 to 34 year olds, uh, 30 and up could generally be the case. So you might want to leave, you know, 25 to 34 year olds, but you really want to know who your market is. And a lot of the times certain age groups will perform a lot better than other age groups. Like say we're installing pools, uh, maybe 65 year olds don't convert as well. Uh, we could get rid of that. Uh, for pools, say we're selling high-end pools. Generally, people in the lower 50% of income aren't going to be buying, you know, $100,000 pools. So we could get rid of that. We could get rid of 40 to 41 to 50. We could get rid of 21 to 30, and just leave 11 to 20% and top 10%. We could also leave unknown as well. Not everyone is going to be known uh, by Google exactly what their age is, their household income is, and what their gender is. So there is a little bit of a, a guesswork in Google Ads and what the actual metrics are when it comes to demographics. But it does a pretty good job at knowing a lot of things. So take everything with a grain of salt, but it does do a pretty good job when it comes to uh, figuring out who and uh, what the person is. Uh, so those are some ways. When it comes to female, male, and unknown, generally I don't mess around with them too much. I go with the data, figure out what the data says. If there's, say, uh, a lot of yeah, super high conversion rates among females, uh, you could you know, maybe get rid of males or vice versa, maybe it's higher conversion rate with males and uh, get rid of females. Um, that being said, it all comes down to following the data at the end of the day, see what it says. Uh, you you probably are gonna be wrong along the line somewhere when it comes to maybe 55 to 64 year olds aren't converting as well as you thought. And maybe you wanna get rid of them or add them. It really depends on what the data says. So follow the data, uh, see where your conversion rates are coming from, see where the, how high quality the leads are, and then go from there and decide on what you should add and get rid of. Uh, so that is demographic settings in a nutshell. It's pretty easy. Uh, once you've set all this up correctly, we can then hit save demographics and now it's going to be set and you will and you will see all of the stats once you start seeing data in the actual account. Like I said, this is a demo account, so there's no data in it right now. Uh, but now that we have set our, edit, uh, our demographics for that specific ad group, it will be saved in here and we can uh, come back and change it at any time. Um, other than that, if you guys have any questions about demographic settings inside Google Ads or any other questions in general about Google Ads, feel free to leave a comment down below. Other than that, you guys have a wonderful day and take care.